Well, fireworks shops across the area are open, but local burn bans may affect sales this year. News Channel 15's Randy Speech joins us live from News Control. He went to a couple of stores today. Well, good, night, or good evening, Heather. While many of the signs have been up across town for quite a while, a lot of stores did not open until earlier today. So it's hard to tell if sales will drop. But the burn ban is something that store owners are watching closely. It's a week before fireworks can be shot off in Fort Wayne. Fireworks stores are ready for business, but aren't sure what the future holds. There's a lot of us uh, that are pretty worried about it. Brandon Heller opened his store in Allen County just today, so it's too early to know if the burn ban will hurt sales. For me to break even right now, it's I'm pretty close to 100,000 to break even. Everybody's got a, a, a big number <laughs> to break even, so I know there's a lot of people worried this year. So. Across town, Phantom Fireworks is open year round. While business was slow today, the manager there says sales have been normal. During the week at Phantom or at any other fireworks store, it does tend to get a little slow, especially during the daytime. Everybody shops in the evenings or on the weekends and getting ready for their parties. If there is a ban come the 4th of July, managers hope officials will change when fireworks can be used. Above all else, we're safety and People are still buying fireworks and they'll just shoot them off at a different time. I really hope they extend, you know, give people a chance to, you know, celebrate letting people shoot, you know, um, you know, a little bit further into the year so people get to enjoy it. And now, many area burn bans will be reviewed again before the 4th of July. Brandon Heller, who we heard from tonight, says he hopes that officials will make an exception to fireworks as we get closer to the holiday. Reporting live tonight from News Control, Randy Spieth, News Channel 15.